there's been great albums that had like 17 tracks on them. Confessions would be one of those. Confessions had so many tracks on there. Confessions or um, 8701. Oh, I, I mean I like both. They're both in my top, but Confessions, Confessions wins for me even though I have more. Like, I mean, you don't have to call and you turn and like, there's so many songs. You got it bad, wow. There's so many songs yeah. in 8701 that was really dope. That was when, that's when Usher was really my favorite, favorite artist in the world. And same thing with Confessions. I think Confessions was more of an important album because it was when he had the success of 8701 and he wanted to deliver again. It's so hard to have a good album that's just like, people feel like you're at your pinnacle and then reach even higher than that. You know what I'm saying? That's why I think Confessions was an important album. And that's why I think Confessions is better enough. The whole concept of Confessions itself was dope. Whatever he did, yeah, whether it was R&B, or a little bit of rock influence, or disco, or like a slow song, whatever he did, he really just obliterated the competition, man. He always just did it the best. Whenever he ventured into something, no one could go there after it. Like he had, he has like the best songs in like six genres for me. And yeah, rest in peace, man. He was definitely, he's definitely the reason why I made music because he was, yeah, he's, he's what made me fall in love with music. He had that, that specialness that made people fall in love with music. You know what I'm saying? People fell in love with him and fell in love with music just from listening to his songs. So. then I'm a perfectionist man. When I go to the studio, you've got to ask the engineers that I'm working with, like I'm just a perfectionist when it comes to recording and, and writing. I listen to a lot of like old interviews with like Quincy Jones and um Michael Jackson where they would mix one song like a hundred times, yeah, and then decide to take the second mix that they did and use it. <laughs> like it's it's just that being meticulous, yeah, it, it definitely pays off and I wanna do something that's gonna be remembered. Do you know what I mean? So like taking time is nothing for me. I'd rather take four days to do one song yeah. than do four songs in four days. Like just because like you know the quality is gonna be better and people can hear that when they listen to it. Do you know what I'm saying? Just like what you were saying earlier. Hopefully that pays off on the whole album.